my oath of office is to the national security of the United States of America. We cannot save Ukraine by dooming the U.S. economy. This bill under consideration would spend $40 billion. This is the second spending bill for Ukraine in two months, and this bill is three times larger than the first. Our military aid to Ukraine is nothing new, though. Since 2014, the United States has provided more than $6 billion in security assistance to Ukraine, in addition to the $14 billion Congress authorized just a month ago. If this bill passes, the U.S. will have authorized roughly $60 billion in total spending for Ukraine. For those who say this is not enough, for those of you in this chamber who say that our military spending is never enough, let's put $60 billion into perspective. According to Elias Youssef, a security assistant at the Stimson Center, Kiev would become the largest yearly recipient of U.S. military aid of the past two decades. Except for the top five countries, $60 billion is more than every other country in the world spends on their entire military expenditures. If this gift to Ukraine passes, our total aid to Ukraine will almost equal the entire military budget of Russia. And it's not as if we have that money lying around. We will have to borrow that money from China to send it to Ukraine.